The following announcement has been paid for by the Mighty Ben Stein. What's up, YouTube? It's the Mighty Ben Stein here, and welcome to another episode of Unboxing Day. Today I am bringing you the unboxing of the April 2016 Video Games Monthly. Now for those of you that don't know, Video Games Monthly is a monthly subscription service similar to Loot Crate and Arcade Block, but instead of getting random junk you'll probably never use, you'll be getting retro video games delivered to you in the mail inside of these white boxes right here. With Video Games Monthly, you have four different boxes to choose from. There's the three game pack, which is $30 a month. There's the four game pack, which is $35 a month. There's the five game pack, which is $40 a month. And then there's the whopping 10 game power pack which is $75 a month. They also have several different game systems to choose from. They have Nintendo, Super Nintendo, Nintendo 64, Game Boy, Game Boy Color, Game Boy Advance, Sega Genesis, Sega Game Gear, the PlayStation 1, and starting this month, they have the Nintendo GameCube. Last month I got the five game box, so this month I decided I was going to upgrade to the 10 game power pack because I got a big, fat income tax refund, so I decided I was gonna make it rain up in this bitch. I make it rain, girl. I make it rain, girl. I make it rain, make it rain, make it rain, girl. The best thing about Video Games Monthly is that you can send them a wish list of the games that you would like to get in future boxes, and you can also catalog your game collection on their website so you don't get any doubles. So with that said, let's get this unboxing underway. Here we go. All right, I got the Video Games Monthly card right here. Telling you, thanking me for subscribing to the box. Oh, snap. I got a three up. Which means that instead of 10 games, I got 13 games in this box. I have a feeling this is going to be good. Game number one. And this is a Game Boy Advance game. Huh. I didn't know this game existed. It's a licensed game, and it is Fear Factor Unleashed. I'm not really sure what to expect out of this one, but I guess it's based on the TV show, so maybe I could find somebody eating bugs or something. I don't know. Huh, what's this? Huh. This looks interesting. Looks like I got a Mario poker chip with... A handle to carry the poker chip in. It's kind of neat. All right, game number two, and it is a Game Gear game. Let's see what it is. Huh. I have this game on the Genesis, but now I have the Game Gear version, and it is X Men. All right, game number three, and it is a Game Boy game. Huh. I didn't know this was on the Game Boy either. But I'm pretty sure it's a good one. It's Fist of the North Star for Game Boy. Alright, game number four. Another Game Gear game. Let's take a look. Huh, interesting. I'm not exactly sure if this is on my wish list or not, but I got Tasmania for Game Gear. Alright, game number five. Another GBA title. Interesting. Not sure if this one's any good or not, but it is Star Wars Flight of the Falcon. Alright, game number six. Another Game Boy Advance title. And I'm kind of curious about this one. It is Driver Advance 2. Game number seven. It's a Genesis game. And it is. Haha, <laughs> this one is on my wish list. And it is Animaniacs. All right, six to go. Let's take a look. And for the first time, we got a Super Nintendo game. And it is. Huh. Kind of like this one. I got Vegas Stakes for Super Nintendo. And we got a sticker. It's of a Koopa Troopa and a Toad. Got a Nintendo game. And it is. Oh, -ho, yes! This one's on my wish list. And I've been wanting to play this 
I actually have been wanting to own this for a long time. It is Dragon Power. This is the first Dragon Ball game ever made on a Nintendo system. And one of the only games brought to America before the year 2002. Looks like a PS1 game. Not in the original case, but take what I can get. Hmm. This is interesting. I got Siphon Filter for the PlayStation. Oh, this one's a complete PS1 game. What is it? Oh! Man, this, I think this is one of my wish lists as well. And it is... Twisted Metal 3! Another PlayStation game. Huh. Another game I've never heard of, but I might give a shot here. And it is Battle Stations for the PS1. Here's the last one, and it's a GameCube game. And it is WWE Day of Reckoning. So to recap, I got one Nintendo game, one Super Nintendo game, one Game Boy game, one Sega Genesis game, two Game Gear games, three Game Boy Advance games, three PS1 games, and one GameCube game. Keep in mind that I'm not going to do the 10 game box every month. This is something I'm probably just going to do every once in a while. I only plan on doing this two, maybe three times a year. So next month I will be going back down to the five game box. And that's going to do it for today. If you like what you saw, click that like button. If you want to see more of this, click that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next video. The preceding announcement has been paid for by the mighty Ben Stein.